going to go back to that sketch. Now. <laughs> oh, <just leave. laughs> surface. Up to next, I'll go to that surface wherever it is. And then just stop once it hits it. Okay. So, so that's the terminations. When I had that on the syllabus, that's watching where it goes. And that's kind of the biggest thing is when you first start, you just do everything blind. And then you decide, oh, I want to make the sticker. And then it doesn't all go all the way through. Then that causes those errors when you try and update it. Because now something on the back side relied on that edge that's no longer there. Then you have to go and try and figure it out. So don't don't use blind unless you know you only want to go a certain depth. Okay. Questions on this one? Any problems? Starting to do the hang of it? Get, getting the constraints. All right, let's do that one. How many sketches is that going to be? No. Need the right pins. So, first sketch would be. Correcting. 
I like to work like a machinist. I get a piece of blank, I want to cut stuff out of it. I try and do that as much as possible, especially if it's kind of rectangular like this. I could cut it here and then add that to it. Either way, kind of works. Depends on what I know. If I know this overall is important, I'll do this. If I know that this is important and then that's something different, that's sticking to a hole or something, then maybe doing that and then that is a separate piece. But without the context, it's kind of hard to make that determination. Uh, so I did that as the first one. Second one, do those two. And why am I doing those two now? Before I said one thing. They're the same thing, right? That's the same as that. I can make those two collinear, those two equal, those two equal. And then I just dimension this one, and that one does the same thing. So that's fine. But there are going to be two closed profiles. Then I'll do that, and that, and that. So that's how I would break that down. So I'll let you guys have at it. Yeah, yeah, unlock you, huh?